guys, it's Yana here. I have something very important to share with you today. So every photographer is going to tell you to print your own photos so that you have something to um, display and to surround yourself with beautiful memories. I'm going to tell you another very important thing. If you, have, if you were born a little bit earlier than digital, then you know such things as film and prints and if your photos were printed, make sure first, make sure that they're stored in a good, safe, dry place. And second, scan them. Oh no! He's all the time. Oh, make sure that they're not end up being moldy. And so bad. if you bear so I think I think the recording is going to go a lot more fun this way and with a little less screams hi hi so a few weeks ago we had no electricity and our um, French pump or whatever we have in our basement did not work because our electricity was not um, on so our basement I need to wipe some butts first and then I will tell so, you more. <laughs> no electricity for a few days. Our basement flooded a little bit in one of the areas and it got to the bag that I had with some of my high school pictures, some of the albums and um, a few other things that got ruined and I'm very sad about that. But now I cannot do anything because I, I don't even know if it's uh, sanitary to take the picture, like the moldy pictures in the scanner. I guess maybe it's okay because it's glass, so it shouldn't affect it too much. Sonia! <gasps> oh, you want to get out? Okay. You want to get out? Okay. <laughs> Happy boy. So, make sure that first you store your photos in a appropriate location. <coughs> And second, no matter what, um, make sure that they're scanned and backed up because there are all kinds of things that can happen to the possessions in your house. And no matter how well they're stored, you still want to make sure that your memories are safe. So I guess advice for today, have digital copy and have a paper copy to make your life happy, make your life good, and have a good day, guys. Bye-bye.